SMT Nation, we are back. Nation, I'm giving you guys the first look at standalone 5G connectivity here in Cleveland, Ohio. Speed testing on a Verizon Frontline account. Uh, Frontline uh, gives us a high QCI, gives us the priority, all those types of things. Shout out to Carlos S. Tech for holding it down for us and providing us this opportunity. And we're on the Samsung Galaxy S24. This is a connection now with standalone 5G, means no LTE, strictly 5G. It's the default setting on standalone 5G here in the Cleveland market. Puts you on 10 megahertz of N5, and it puts you at 100 megahertz of N77. So it's a two carrier aggregation setup for them. Uh, it's not, by default at least, it's not the two N77s, which would have been 100 megahertz of N77, an additional 40 megahertz of N77. So it's 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 a little bit of a different setup uh, than I than I think some connections. I guess some people would have projected would have been the connections, but anyways, it's uh it's not a finished product. I can tell you guys right now, it is kind of sort of beta, and it's not bad, but it's not ideal. <laughs> I'm gonna continue to test it here throughout the day. You guys can see we've seen a couple hundred, few hundred megabits per second downlink, and now we're seeing about nine megabits per second uplink. Right, so we're all over the place with it. Uh, now we're we're back fast here. Uh, I also uh, enabled the uh, the millimeter wave bands as well. Uh, so if we end up getting some connectivity to those millimeter wave nodes, we can check those things out too here. But just some preliminary testing. The ping times, the jitter, the load of pings. It's the same as I saw with NSA 5G. I haven't really noticed anything different there. Here's 400 down and 10 up. But uh, it, it's been pretty stable. It stayed connected. I never disconnected from the SA 5G. Never said no signal. So I guess it is stable in that respect. All right, so quick first look. Standalone 5G for Verizon on C-band N77 and the low-band N5. Thanks for watching.